Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a reading for Gemini. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the week of November 30th through December 5th. We're going to try to do you and the other person. We're going to see what comes up. I'm not sure what side is going to be yours, but typically I say this side is yours, this is them, this is the overall connection. So we're going to see what comes up for you, Gemini. What do we got? Nine of Swords, very, very worried, very worried, uh, being haunted by something, worried about an outcome, uh, scared, somebody is scared, scared of what's going to happen next. Seven of Wands reversed, now that's some sort of fight, right? That's, that's stepping down though, it's being defeated, it's surrendering. So somebody's going to be surrendering, they're going to be giving up, they, they don't have any fight left by the looks of things. Overwhelmed, warm down. Somebody is definitely overwhelmed and warm down. It's like, I can't do this anymore. This is very overwhelming. Can't fight, no fight left. Um, definitely a dead end. So we have some, whether it's you or the other person, not following through, no desire to do this, don't don't care to do it, no, no desire. So somebody is giving up on something with that uh, line up right there. Okay, this is too much. It's extremely exhausting. Extremely. There's no desire to do this. No no reason to do this. Um, there's lack of commitment, dropping out. Um, don't want this responsibility anymore. I'm not interested. So somebody is not interested in putting in any more effort. It is too overwhelming. So I don't know if that's you or them. Three of coins reverse, lack of teamwork, Nobody, somebody's not putting in enough effort, the end of a contract. So somebody, I feel like you're dealing with a third party or you're dealing with somebody that is ending a contract. Maybe you have given up on them. You know, you're, you're exhausted, you're fed up, you have no desire to put in any more effort. Now this person is getting out of a contract, they're breaking a contract. Ah, uh, geez, some crow. Five of Wands reversed. Now the Five of Wands reversed could be light at the end of the tunnel, right? Um, it is cooperating, finding a solution. Um, it's the end of a conflict. And I think there's been some sort of conflict. Somebody has been playing games, maybe with a false contract, maybe with a lover. Maybe, you know, somebody was playing games. They involved themselves with a third party. They weren't ready to settle down, but now that's over by the looks of things. Because um, that is the end of a contract, a separation of some sort. Whoever you're dealing with um, may be getting out of a relationship. You know, this is a broken relationship. Detaching. There's some sort of one-sidedness here. Um, hmm. Knight of Swords reversed. Nine of Wands facing some challenges. You are facing some challenges with another person. Extreme challenges. I feel like you've been pushed away. I think that somebody pushed you away. They didn't put in effort. They gave up prematurely. I feel, and I feel like now they may be uh, exhausted. They may be, uh, obviously this person is worn down. They're worn down. They're, uh, hurt somebody is hurt seven of coins reversed so that's very frustrated we have somebody here that is uh not happy they're very dissatisfied they're dissatisfied with with their actions i feel like you're deal you dealt you i feel like you are dealing with an individual who may have moved too fast. They, maybe they moved too quickly into another partnership and it's not working out by the looks of things. Queen of Cups, you could be, that's on the bottom of the deck, you could be dealing with a water sign. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, it doesn't have to be. This is somebody that is very loving typically, but can be very closed off emotionally. Doesn't, uh, you know doesn't open up their heart as easily as you would think that they do. 
Anyhow, I feel like there is an opportunity for love here. I feel like somebody may be expressing their feelings to you. They are probably embarrassed. I feel like there is somebody that is embarrassed by their mistakes. They, they're in no hurry. They're in no hurry to show up because I feel like they are embarrassed. Something hasn't worked out with this person. And it doesn't have to be a lover. It could be somebody that you uh, have been fighting with. You've been fighting with somebody. Um... Anyhow, somebody is very, very dissatisfied. They're dissatisfied probably with a relocation or a move or something like that because the Seven of Coins, I consider a relocation. They've really been thinking about it. They've been thinking about what their next step should be. Anyhow, I feel like you are very stressed out. I feel like you're stressed out. I feel like you have given up. I feel like you're not putting any in any more effort into some sort of situation. I feel like you've lost enough sleep on this already. I feel like uh, you've surrendered, right? You've surrendered. You've decided that you're not going down this path, right? You've decided that, you know, you're going to be realistic, you're going to be practical, you don't have anything to offer, perhaps you're not offering anything because this has already caused you so much stress. You know, you don't need the stress in your life. And I feel because that is the case for the Three of Pentacles, whoever you're dealing with um, is separating. They're separating. There's some sort of separation here where the lovers reverse. There's a separation of a, of a false contract, right? It is. Um... I feel like there's a fight that causes a separation with, I don't know if it's with somebody that you were with, and there could definitely be a fight. And you may you may be like, oh my God, I can't take this anymore. That If you are in a relationship with somebody right now, there could be a fight that causes a separation. Just saying. If you are single, you may be dealing with somebody that is fighting with their partner. You know, they're fighting with their partner. And, um, you know, they, they may... Uh, be worn down and looking for some tender loving care so beware anyhow um nine of wands facing some life challenges i feel like uh the main challenge between you and whoever this person is 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 wanting to win you know both of you want to win you want to win at all costs if you can if you can let bygones be bygones if you can give up if you can uh let your guard down and give it give things a chance give things a chance to work themselves out things could work out but the main challenge is fighting you know you know not wanting to give up not wanting to budge maybe maybe you need to learn how to budge you need to learn how to walk away you know um i feel like uh you, you right now things are right now things are not moving in the direction that you would like them to move because there's too much lack of compromise somebody if you could comp compromise is needed somebody needs to compromise they need to have respect and i feel like there's lack of respect whoever you're dealing with may not respect you they may not respect your your uh position it feels like you are in a very tough position and and i feel like they keep on bringing you down bringing you down bringing you down i feel like you're really worried about what is going to happen next but i also feel like uh You shouldn't give up. You should not give up. I feel like you should continue to fight. I know that you probably feel like giving up. You feel like giving up. You feel like surrendering. But I feel like I feel like there is a chance. There is a chance that you know you could get what you want if you if you let go of your fears. I feel like there's some sort of fear here. There is fear. But there's fear. There's fear of of uh something working out and my advice is to invest keep investing don't give up have faith you need to have faith you need to believe okay i feel like you're losing your faith you're losing your faith in some sort of commitment and i feel like you need to have faith i feel like there's there's some sort of uh disharmony here within a connection whoever you are dealing with 
um, I feel like this person is going to give up their stance if you can make some compromises as well. You may need to make some compromises. <sighs> somebody is looking for a fight as well. So I don't know who this is, but you're you got somebody around you that is looking for a fight. And they're waiting for you to give up. They're waiting for you to, they're pushing you right to the edge. So I feel like you need to really master your emotions. You're going to need to master your emotions. Your perseverance and your determination will make you successful if you don't give up. So I don't know how that resonates with you. But I feel like uh, you're being pushed to give up. But do not give up. Um, yeah, I feel like you're you're really fighting. You're really you're really you really have some strong competition here. Extremely strong competition. Somebody may be fighting for your love. They may be fighting for your lover. You know what I mean? And that could be the competition. You know, you may you may have somebody that is fighting for your lover. Okay, but I think that you're going to prevail. I think that you're going to, you may be feeling like, oh my God, oh my God, I'm, I'm going to lose. You're not going to lose. You're not going to lose. I don't feel like you're going to lose. I feel like you need to um, have faith. I feel like you need to have faith. Um, I feel like you 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 are losing your ambition, right? Or that other person is with that three of coins reversed. That's lack of the ambition, and there's definitely lack of harmony with others. So whoever you is competing is is uh, they're losing their they're losing their grip. Okay, they're losing their grip. They're losing the battle. So you know they're not winning, even though they think that they're winning. They're not winning. Okay. So I feel like you need to keep going, <laughs> whatever that means. Don't give up. Don't give up. Um, now on the bottom, we I just shuffled. We have the magician. The magician is act, taking action to bring success, being, being doing whatever it takes to bring success. This is a yes answer. You will get what you want. You will succeed. This is about becoming self-aware, becoming focused, remain focused, take charge. You have a golden opportunity right now to create whatever you want. And I feel like that's what you're going to be doing. This is somebody who does something. Do not give up. Do not, And this is you. So I feel like you have the power, you have the resources to succeed in whatever it is that you're trying to do. But I feel like there's disharmony with others this week. There is going to be disharmony with others. There's going to be fighting with others. And it's more than one person, so be prepared for that. Maybe the best thing for you to do is to walk away. Be prepared to deal with some conflicts this week, just so you know. Okay, they're probably going to be coming at you from every freaking direction. So be prepared to deal with some conflicts this week. And I feel like the best plan of action is for you probably to walk away and work on creating, you know, a plan for the future. Just work on your future. Focus on your future. Okay, um, do not give up, but perhaps you need to retreat. Perhaps you're definitely going to be dealing with a lot of challenges this week. Okay. Um, some of them could be financial challenges. Okay. There could be some financial challenges. Um, there's some sort of dissatisfaction in regards to relocating, you know, you, but I feel like, uh, you're going to overcome them. I think that you have come a really, really, really long way. I feel like your determination is going to pay off. Things may be happening in a very slow pace, but things are still happening. Okay. You have the power. You do. This is you having the power to succeed. You have all the resources to succeed. It's just going to take some time. You may have to learn some new skills. 
You may have to learn some new skills. You may have to do some new things. You may have to work with people you have never worked with before. All right? So anyway, Gemini, I feel like this week you are going to be having disharmony with others. People are going to be, maybe they're going to be blaming you for things, you know, pointing the finger at you. You're probably going to be like, oh my God, where the hell is this coming from? This is absolutely overwhelming. I feel like you are going to be overwhelmed by all the demands or all the fingers that are pointing at you. But I'm here to tell you that you are strong. You are a very strong person and you can overcome these challenges. So I feel like this is a week of you taking control, becoming aware of what is going on and just taking a step back. I feel like this week you need to step step back, okay? Don't fight. Try not to fight with whoever these people are or this person is. You know, don't fight with this person. Just retreat. Okay, this person is trying to bring you down. You are absolutely 100% being tested. This is just one week. It will not last. So anyway, Gemini, I feel like, um, yeah, there, there's some sort of... Uh, This is out of your control. You got it. It needs to happen. This needs to happen. This is facing life challenges. This is going to be a week of facing challenges, and that's all there is to it. But you will prevail. You will prevail. I know that you will. Whoever you are dealing with is trying to cause disharmony. They are trying to fight. They want to pick a fight. So get prepared. They're going to be testing your strength. Your strength is going to be your perseverance. Your stamina is going to be tested. I don't think you're going to be happy. You're not going to be happy. This person, whoever this person is, is is, is wanting to uh, stop you from doing something. You know, they're trying to stop you from going someplace or getting the getting the outcome that you desire. I do feel like you will find a solution. And it may be to, you know, separate. Good luck. <laughs>